Every banner does impact differently for different people. I think it's important for people to know that they're not alone, that there's many people who are like them, who have gone for them, and who have been uh, had the courage to speak up and be visible when it was dangerous and an undesirable thing to do. It's important to know our history and know where people have been, what has worked, what has not worked, and what needs attention in the present. The Banner Project is a pop-up exhibit of LGBT history from Houston, and it's 48 banners and counting showcase the culture, the history, the organizations, the people, the events, the bars that, that formed the culture. The Banner Project was founded by Sarah Fernandez. I went to New York and saw a couple of exhibits at museums and they had activists and they had, you know, visuals and they had TV monitors and they had these wonderful displays. And I thought, Houston needs that. And so I, I submitted a proposal and it was accepted. And then the panic struck because I didn't have a real plan and I didn't have money and, and I didn't know what I was doing. And I started relying on people in the community who would know history and who could visualize history. And that's when the group sort of came together. I asked Kirk if he would do the design. I asked uh, JD offered historical bits. I decided that the history was so important and for people to see it and to visualize it uh, was important to me. After the initial exhibition, the Banner Project became a pop-up exhibit of LGBTQ Houston history, where people can see events, people, organizations, and know how things developed or where things have been, what has worked, what hasn't worked, and now can also be found on the internet at HoustonWeHaveHistory.org. I hope when people see the banners that they will find themselves in the banners and find the potential to create change.